Were you part of Saturday's cleanup? You. Which one is that? And and uh, Russell and um, Phil. Or was oh, it a no, different that was job? Bobby. Uh, oh, Bobby. I'm sorry, Bobby. Yeah, and Phil that was, Yeah, that was a chainsaw cleanup. But... I heard they did yeoman's work from like nine in the morning till dark stopped them. Yeah, well, I got two questions for you. How long does it take to paddle 2.4 miles? When there's no water? <laughs> yeah, yeah. A, a lot, I, I imagine. 12 hours in this case. Is that what it took him? Dragging and paddling? Two hours after dark, yes. Now remember, cleanup all along the way and chainsaws all along the way. That's they were, correct. They were making it a, a passable, navigable waterway. That's right. And here's my other question. So what happened when I crawled up a 30-foot bank out of the river, went around to a tiny suburban street in Wood Valley covered in chainsaw dust <laughs> and river dirt and knocked they, on the door? They called the cops. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I, I was wondering if I was going to be met with a shotgun. I heard somebody bought you pizza pies. That's right. The guy answered the door says, I know you. I went to your river song event. I said, we got an event down there. Can you hear the chainsaws? And he brought us pizza. That is fantastic. Um, yes, and people uh, salute that effort. Uh, they got down 